Hello guys, I'm Isaac from Isaac TV and I hope you guys are doing really well. In this episode, we're going to do stuff a little bit differently. As you can see, I've got a bag here and inside the bag, I have some dinosaurs, but I'm going to talk about that later. I've got cookies, I've got crisps, I've got an orange, and if I'm feeling a bit thirsty, I've got my favourite bottle of lemon and lime prime. So I'm going to take a sip of that right now anyways. Thirsty. Now, let's get started. I'm going to show you around the woods, review these dinosaurs and explore. Such a wild boar. I'm a bit hungry, so now I'm going to take a break. refreshing. The wild boar statue is a symbol that wild boar used to live in here. forest there's probably a lot of wildlife such as foxes deers and birds and maybe even squirrels let's check what's out there As it's starting to rain, I think I should go back and review my dinosaurs before the rain gets really heavy. So, in front of you I have the Jurassic World Dominion T-Rex. But before I go on to talk about the figure, I'm going to tell you some facts about it. The T-Rex lived in the late Cretaceous period, which was around 90 to 66 million years ago. So, how do we know this? One way of knowing is having a look at the fossil posi position in the ground. Tyrannosaurus rex was the most fearsome and powerful predators of all time. Although T-Rex is one of the most renowned dinosaurs of all time, there is only a few complete fossils found. The first T-Rex fossil to be ever discovered was discovered by an American keeper of Natural History Museum called Barnum Brown. The T-Rex was around 40 feet in length and around 12 feet in height. The T-Rex is estimated to be weighed around 11 to 15 and a half thousand pounds or 5 to 7 
thousand in kilograms. With skin and flesh on its huge bones, that's as much as the largest African elephant. As the rain is getting quite heavy, I'm going to quickly move over to the Triceratops. In front of you, I've got the Jurassic World Dominion Triceratops. The Triceratops first appeared in the late Cretaceous period, which is around 68 million years ago. It got extinct in the Cretaceous Paleogene Extinction. I'm going to tell you a little bit about the Cretaceous Paleogene Extinction. It was a sudden extinction which killed most of the animal and plant species on Earth. It was approximately 66 million years ago and it marked the end of the Cretaceous period. The three horns on a Triceratops face defended itself against big predators such as its rival the T-Rex. The Triceratops is also known to have its iconic frill which would scare away the predators. As you can see guys, the rain's starting to get really heavy, so I think it's time for me to go. So before I go, make sure you subscribe to my channel. Take care, goodbye.